joining me. Hi, everybody. I'm Catherine from the Sewing Studio at Lady Lake in the Sewing Studio Fabric Superstore. Thank you for taking the time to join me this morning. I want to talk to you, especially with the explosion of cork and vinyl being so popular with wallets and little bags, of how to finish off your edges. Commercially, when you go pick up a purse from somewhere, you'll notice that the edges of your strapping is often sealed with some sort of edge coat or some sort of kind of like rubberized glue. Well, how can I do that in the home for the homemaker of these things? Uh, and especially since we now have access to so many cool patterns and things that we can make on our own. Well, there are several different methods to doing it, but today I'm going to talk to you about one of the most efficient, uh, not time consuming and inexpensive ways of finishing off the edges of your cork and or vinyl. Okay, so first of all, I wanted to let you know that I did this pattern from uh, So Many Creations and it's a free pattern she has online. It's called the Daybreak Cork Wallet. So the Daybreak Cork Wallet is this little bag right here. She has little credit card strips on one side, she has a pocket on the other side and she has an opening in the middle for you to store any little things that you want to store in there. Super cool, super easy little um, pattern. It made up super quick and I really enjoyed it and I loved this new printed vinyl that we got for this project. Okay, so that's first and foremost. Now, what kind of things did I use to finish off the edges of my piece? Well, first of all, you have to decide when you're looking at cork and vinyls. We've got so many pretty corks and vinyls out there, but sometimes on the edges, on the inside, on the raw side, you end up with this um, white and or brown that is an unfinished look to your vinyl and cork, especially the vinyls where you've got these really pretty colors on your vinyl, but then here on the end, you have this white on white peeking through. So it doesn't look as complete or finished as it could. Well, here's how we handle that portion of it. All right, so first of all, Eileen Roche from Dime came out with these wonderful fabric markers. Well, they're not just for fabric. When you have these markers, you can actually pick a color because there's 20 different colors to match the vinyl that you've got so that you can paint the inside of your vinyl so that when the edges are sewn together, you have a color on the outside as well as the vinyl on the out right side of the fabric. So for instance, this particular vinyl that I used is really pretty on one side and white in the middle. So how did I take care of that? Well, I'm going to go and get my pink because that's what I chose to use, my pink color. And right on the edge of my vinyl, I'm going to take the edge of my marker and I'm just going to seal the edge right there with a little bit of pink so that as I've sewn my edges together and folded it together, now you'll be looking at pink on pink instead of white on white. The other thing is that if you've got a vinyl that you might have a little extra distance on, you can see here in the corner, you can still see white peeking through. So not only did I colorize the very edge of the vinyl, but then I also took my marker and right on the edge of my fabric, probably from up top, Mr. Eric, I'm gonna roll my ink into the edge there. So I've got a little bit of extra color within my vinyl there. So let me put that on my hand where you can see it. So here we have on the edge of this, the pink edge so that when this part is folded together, now you have a more complete pink look within your vinyl right there. See, now you don't see white peeking through. So that's step one in the process. Once you've completed that part of the process, you're gonna sew your bag or your wallet or whatever you're doing because at the very end, we're gonna finish off our edges. Again, with that kind of rubberized look, but our way. So 
Aliens Fabric Fusion Glue. This stuff is really cool. You often see it used with people who just want um, a good way to hold stuff together um, for a kind of semi-permanently way to hem pants and stuff for people who don't sew. However, you can use this product for other things. You can seal off the edges of your bags and your corks with this. Super, super easy because it has a fine tip. So let's show you that part of the process. Again, if we're looking at the raw edge of our bag in here, what we want to do is you're going to open up whatever you've got so that there's no parts sticking on any parts. Then get your paper towel nearby. You're going to squeeze just a bead of glue along that part of the outside edge of your piece. All right, once you've done that, work in little sections and just kind of pat it in. You wanna squeeze that glue into any of these multiple sections or multiple pockets. And by doing that, you're going to give it a nice finish. Be careful not to smush around to the outside or inside of your piece. You really just want to keep that glue on the edge and then wipe off your excess, get rid of it, and start with another bit. Work on another section of your wallet. So you'll just keep on going. And it says give it two to four hours to dry. And once you've done that, you can now see the edge of this is a little bit shiny here. Let me move it forward. Yeah, there it is. You can see a little bit of shine versus the unshiny, unfinished, raw edge portion of the bag, of the cork. See, this one's complete and it's actually set in. The color is kind of set in versus out here where it's raw. And that's it. That's all you have to do. And you've taken your mostly awesome project to super awesome. So again, Aliens Fabric Fusion Glue and Dime the um, Fabric Permanent Markers, they're really going to help you have a number of colors and a nice finish on that final product. Thank you so much for joining me. If you could be sure and like us on Facebook, like the video, share the video, and subscribe to our YouTube channel, we sure would appreciate it. I appreciate you being here with me. Have a great day, everybody. Bye-bye.